The water level is dropping at the Oroville Dam, but for how long? I'm Virginia Cho. I'm Jason Martinez. Everyone who evacuated may have to leave again. Crews are still lowering rocks into the damaged spillway. The reservoir has dropped 20 feet since it overflowed Sunday, but officials want it to drop 50 feet and more rain is on the way as early as tonight. Almost 200,000 people who evacuated are being allowed to go back home, but first responders say they may have to leave again if repairs to the spillway don't hold. Many of the people say they're going to stay put at evacuation shelters. It makes me very nervous, but of course we'll just keep the radio on and tuned on for any information. And as soon as they say, hey, you know what, you got to go again, doors are being shut and I'm out of there. I'd like to go home, but the storm's supposed to come. I don't think it's a really good idea. Watch the storm come and then send us back here. I figure we should just stay. Well, my main concern is being home and something going on, and then we have to come up back this way and we're still going to be faced with the long lines. And it's just a matter of being safe. All those residents are watching the weather reports closely, and they are not the only ones. So is our own meteorologist, Megan Perry. This is some serious stuff, so just how yeah. bad is it going to get? Well, we're not only talking about one storm. We're talking about a series of storms that's going to be starting as early as tonight. Right now, I'm not convinced all this is making it to the ground. Maybe a few sprinkles, a few showers here or there. The heaviest rain is yet to come. You can see that moisture all out into the ocean. That's going to be a parade of storms we're going to see rolling into our area. Another atmospheric river event. That means there's a lot of moisture with it. And that chance for rain really picks up overnight tonight into tomorrow morning with more rain headed straight into the weekend. That's the rain that's going to be headed here locally. I'm going to be talking about the heavy rain and strong winds expected here in San Diego in your full forecast.